Sprout again. Should destroy the area if I want to get rid of them for good. Faster. Self didn't kill him, bled to death afterwards. Notes clear. Someone's out to sabotage Coronada. Shame I don't know who. Though I could still find out if I keep looking.
Filth filters at Vermentino. Gah! It's not worth tiring my tongue. Search of herbs for a new flavored wine. Well, suddenly. Calm down, it's over. The bang did less kidnapped me. In hopes of collecting a ransom, I'm sure. But with Master Liam's troubles, he never could have paid them. Ah, but I'm free and safe, thanks to you. Should you need any herbs, I've a hearty stock at the Coronata. Will you work me there? Lead the way, right behind you. Here we are. Once again, I thank you for the rescue. Wish to look over my stock? Master Liam doesn't seem a diligent proprietor. He tries as best he can. It's not his fault our vineyard suffered plague upon plague. Plagues? What kind? Well, the enormous yellow man-eating sun juice, for instance. You cannot set foot into the brush for fear of coming out a head shorter. Show me what you got. Thanks. See you later. Come now, Madame. 
Come on, Roach. That's it, Roach. Or killed him. Interesting. This oh, letter is what I found key. earlier. In a place like this, place. causing problems with the interesting. Engineers.
Let's go! I owe you my life, unknown knight. How were you dubbed? Dubbed Geralt. Geralt of Rivia. My thanks, Sir Geralt. The scully wags sought to demolish our herb garden, you see. I thought I shall take a hum, scare the rubble off, but to my great chagrin, there were too many, and I... I failed. Ah, there's no use crying over spilt wine. Come with me to Vormentino. I'll patch up your armor or pound the anvil to fulfill some other need you might have. Fine. Lead the way. Here we are. Is there some way I might help you? Vineyard's glory days seem like a thing of the past. It seemed better times true. For bandits are not our only problem. Enormous yellow parasites, their ever-growing plague we also must contend with. Maid Matilda tries her best, but when folk fear to go out and work, what is she to do? All right, what do you have? Craft something for me, can you? Thanks. See you later.
that means. Is it the jungle to cultivate something like this? Need to incinerate them before they spew spores and spread. Sabotage at both vineyards. Gotta tell Matilda and Liam. Master Witcher, have you any news? This vineyard, Belgard, why is it so valuable? <laughs> you are not from here, it certainly shows. Before Count Crespi fell prey to the beast, Belgard belonged to him. As a man of wealth and influence, he guided it to immense success, brought in rare grape varieties, hired skilled workers. I shan't trouble you with unnecessary details. Suffice to say that merging Belgard with another vineyard is a sure recipe for success. One and the same man caused Coronada's and Vermentino's problems. Got proof. A certain Count Crespi. He's at the root of it all. What, Crespi? Belgard's erstwhile owner? Why, that's impossible. Got it all here, in writing. He did indeed have motive. He knew well his own vineyard could not survive if Vermentino and Coronata were to join forces. Probably why he incited the feud. Pulled it off, too, mostly. Just failed to bring his plan to completion when the beast got him. Incredible! You mean to say it... it wasn't Liam? And I was certain my troubles were Matilda's doing. <clears throat> In light of new evidence, uh... The most just resolution would be for both injured parties to share oversight of Belgard. Wait just a minute. Do you mean to suggest we're to cooperate? It's the optimal solution, yes. In terms of the health of the Enterprise as well. Hmm. I can't believe I'm saying this, but I do believe he's right. Perhaps it is time to bury the hatchet. Three vineyards are more than one. There's much to be gained. So be it. That's not all. The troubles at your vineyards? Solved them. You can go back to operating normally now. Splendid news. I'm relieved to see you hired a professional, especially one whose aid might still prove invaluable. But let's not get ahead of ourselves. Follow me. It's high time you saw Belgard. Witcher, come with us, please. Something tells me we'll have tasks for you yet. All right, let's go. My desire for Belgard to pass into capable hands was no idle whim. 
where the vineyards fallen upon. I've been told of workers dying on their rounds, monsters prowling about. Before anyone can call this home, they will have to deal with these um, inconveniences. That is the minister's wish. More work for me, I guess. If you're willing, we'll gladly accept your help. I can help, sure, but I won't work for free. A bit less? A bit less? A bit less? Fine. We have a deal. More or less already agreed, I guess. Oh, that's a weight off my chest, I must say. Your reward shall be fair, I promise. I'll get to work. Destroy it.
Thank you, sir. Were it not for you, well, those bandits were not pulling pranks. I could pound some new steel for you in gratitude, but I must first return to my workshop in Belgard. Let's go. No time to lose. I thank you again for your aid. Care to glance at my wares? What were you doing in the Caraberta woods? And how'd you wind up a prisoner of those bandits? Ever since the Count died, I've not had the resources to buy raw materials. Meaning no new barrel hoops, no tools. So I mustered a few lads and went into the woods to scavenge. A great deal of scrap to be had in those elfin ruins. If you don't mind digging, folks say the place is haunted, but I've no fear of elfin ghosts. A rational man. Rational or superstitious, it matters not. The point is, I did not see a single ghost. Yet a Hansa, yes, that we ran into. Though it seems I've more luck than sense, because you came along to save me. Show me what you have. to Belgard's problems. Vineyard should be in as good a shape as ever. Splendid. And thus, officially, by the power vested in me, I grant you title to the Belgard Vineyard, and trust that you shall make good use of its grounds and resources. Excellent. Ah, I can already smell the grapes ripening into sun. We shan't forget what you did for us. Here, your pay. But that's not all. You must come back and see us shortly. We've a surprise in store for you. I'll do that. Farewell. Oh, Witcher. Greetings. Kind of you to come. Matilda and I, we've a surprise for you. Hmm. You two seem to be getting along. We are. There came a point we realized we had no grounds to quarrel. Things became altogether pleasant. And a bit spicy. Romantic. Quite. Got it. Needn't say more. Glad things are going well for you. What's the surprise? Some new monster I need to kill? No. Something far more pleasant. We've produced a wine. According to the best sommeliers, it might just dethrone Est Est. We owe this success to you. So... If you'd agree... We'd like to name it after you. What shall we call it? Why not White Wolf? Wild. With character. It fits perfectly. 
If you wouldn't mind, we'd like to send a few bottles to your home every so often. I'd be honored. Thanks. No, we thank you. Take care, Witcher. I swear on my... Scatter them to the winds and drive them from our duchy!